Did you buy a Toro Power Clear 518? Well, this is going to be your very average unboxing, assembly, and first start. Looks neat and tidy. This unit's about 55 pounds. I just lifted it out of the box. Um, and you can see what came inside the box. Uh, the nuts and bolts are just kind of thrown in there. Um, see the chute and the oil. Um, and the operator's manual would need a download from the internet. You can see the carriage bolt comes from the outside to the inside through the bars followed by the saddle washer and plastic hand nut. handle and the chute need to be meshed together and then aligned with the holes on the machine. This is plastic here so I opted to use a Phillips screwdriver rather than an impact driver. Now for filling the oil, um, this used the entire bottle, uh, which is 12 ounces, of the oil that was provided in the box. I'm also a fan that the oil has a zinc additive in it. It's great for engine break-in. So now that the oil is full, let's take a look at this. It's a nice looking machine. Upon further inspection, I did find some shipping damage, a couple of scrapes, and small dents shouldn't affect the performance in any way. I probably should cover the scratches with black paint though. I recommend using non-ethanol or non-oxygenated gas in the small engines. I think we're ready for first start.
it is folks still waiting on some snow to test this thing out and thanks for watching